One, two, three, four. A limited. When your date seems like blah, 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 blah. Try to imagine this. When Tia moved in for that kiss, all I could think was finally this date is starting to heat up. When all you can hear is blah, 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 blah. Just try and think of this. Take it off! Simmer down, simmer down. <laughs> Three get the axe, one gets the date. Threw off my top, showed my stuff, and it was fun. Blah, 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 blah. It all starts now. A limited. One, two, three, four. A limited. <laughs> I'm Adam. I'm a bartender landscaper in Seattle. I'm very, very picky when it comes to women, you know? I have very high standards, and if you can't rise to meet those standards, I'm sorry, you're gone. They gotta be perfect, you know? Nice breasts, nice ass. I, I'm, I'm not a breast man, I'm an ass man, I'll admit it. Women, for me, they're, they're a challenge, they're a love, they're a joy, and they're just a hassle sometimes, but, uh, you know, we'll, we'll give it one more shot. A limited. <laughs> Well, I decided to start my date here in Kirkland, Washington, uh, down here at the harbor, the water. I'm taking the girls to the beach cafe. We'll get them a few drinks, get them relaxed and comfortable with themselves and uh, go from there. I don't know what the problem is with girls. They just don't like me. I don't get along with them, so I just don't even try. I'm Tia and I'm a huge flirt and a lot of times it gets me in trouble with other girls. Hi. Hi. Madam. How are you? I'm Tia. Nice to meet you. When I first got a look at Tia, she came up and she's cute. The thing that's going to set me apart on this day is probably my height advantage. My name's Vanessa, and I'm a tall chick, and I'd like to find somebody bigger than me. Hello. Well, oh, oh, I'm oh, right wow. over here. <laughs> <laughs> What's your name? Vanessa. Vanessa, nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Wow. I mean, this girl is hot. Most of my friends say I'm a little bit goofy and I can be the life of the party, but just don't give me too much alcohol. I'm Desiree and I'm not going to be the slutty girl on this date. And Hi. you are? I'm Desiree. Desiree. Nice Hi. to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. He was hot, I love the chops, and he looks like a bad boy and I love bad boys. Over a year ago, I caught my boyfriend cheating on me and uh, that was the best thing that could have happened to me. My name is Valicia and because of my ex, I am on my guard with guys. Hi there. Hi. I'm Alicia. Hi, I'm Adam. Thank you. No need for handshakes. We're all friends here. <laughs> all right. <laughs> wow, I mean, this girl could be Swedish. She's uh, incredible. You guys ready for the date? Ready. Yeah? Let's go. Go down to the beach club. I took the girls to the beach cafe, got them a few drinks, and they started to loosen up. So what do you guys like to do for fun? <laughs> I, I like going out with my friends, and um, I like to go to clubs and bars, but when I don't do that, I like to cook. Really? Mm -hmm. What about you? I enjoy going out with friends and going dancing and going to clubs. Sounds you know? exciting. And I have a cute little cat that I like to play with. What's his name? Her name's Flip. Flip. She flips like somersaults and she flips out. She's crazy. Okay. So. I don't know why she even brought that up. I don't think anybody really gives a damn about her cat. I love to dance, go to bars, hang out with friends. What's your style? Um, I'm really into like punk music, indie no, punk. No, dancing. Oh, dancing? Yeah. Um, like modern, you know. Modern dance. Yeah, not anything. No poles, no. Oh, definitely pole dancer. Definitely pole definitely dancer. Definitely a pole dancer. Well, we're gonna have to find that one out yeah. a little bit more up close and personal. Pole dancer? Later on. Um, I have once or twice. Are you a stripper? Uh, no. Okay. Not a stripper. I've been to strip club a couple times, and the girls, they pull you up and, you know, on stage and do it. And I wish they'd pulled me up. <laughs> um, if Tia wants to strip down for me tonight, show me what she's got. Go for it. I'm all, I'm game. This is gonna sound like, like cliche, but I want to be an actress. Really? Yes. Oh. Have you done anything? <laughs> done. Sorry, like, like acting wise, have you done okay. um, commercials? Yeah. Have you been in any movies? Or anything? Yeah, I've been in a few. What? Um, <laughs> was in, actually, have you guys heard of The Ring? Oh uh, yeah. Okay. For that? Right. Okay. There's actually a scene in there where. We uh, had to get naked. There's a flashback, and there's about 15 guys and girls um, were naked, and we're like slithering all over each other in like this honey like goo. Do you like getting naked a lot? <laughs> um, I don't know. That's have not problem necessary. With it. <laughs> Basically, yeah, you're just in a scene where you're all gooey and naked. <laughs> yeah, they well, they pay a lot of money, so I figured you know everybody's professional. Yeah. So you're on TV naked? Yeah. Except uh, for they don't show my our faces, and they cover uh, up my tattoos. Uh, Tia, there's no two ways about it. You're a slut. All right, em em embarrassing moments. What is your most embarrassing moment? I was at a bar and I was taking a shot with some 
some guy. And um, <laughs> he threw up. Like, you think that but that's not embarrassing? Like, that should embarrass him, right? But he threw up on me. Oh, oh my that's yeah. horrible. That is definitely not a very sexy thing to bring up. And if I was Adam, um, I kind of would be weary. It's not very attractive. Well, this was before I was 21, and we were just sitting around. We were like, oh, great, we can't get alcohol at 10 o'clock at night. How are we going to get drunk? We need to get drunk now. And they're like, okay, if we haul ass right now, we can make it to Canada by probably midnight, which is like 10 o'clock. She just kept rambling on about stories, couldn't really hear her, didn't really care. Desiree goes on and on. It's just like blah, 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 blah. So then we each got five beers, because we're like, we gotta pound these, because the bar's closing, we're in the Roxy, and we're like, we gotta get out of here. And so, blah, 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 blah. We talked to this bouncer guy, and we're like, oh, can we crash at your house? And he's like, okay, sure. Blah, 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 blah. So what happened? <laughs> all right, well anyways, we get busted at the roadblock and we all get kicked out of Canada. Desiree, the Canada story, I'm sorry. Falling asleep, uninteresting, not working for me. We haven't gotten to you yet. Yeah. I have one from the other day, actually. Um, we were at a bar, we were doing karaoke last Sunday. And I decided to go, I had to go to the bathroom. So I went into the bathroom, I was going to the bathroom, and they all decided to rush the stall and take me out of the bathroom like mid going to the bathroom and bring me out into the bar like Didn't you lock with my the pants stall? down. <laughs> they kicked it open. Oh they kicked it open. Okay. It was so embarrassing. And they took These are guys? It was three guys. Three guys. And they carried me out into the, the bar. Yeah. And um I had my pants down on my And they were you peeing? I was trying. Are <laughs> you like peeing along the way? <laughs> no, not after that but <laughs> Tia keeps talking about herself being naked, but underneath those clothes, I don't think she's gonna look that good. Adam's first cut is next, and later. You know, all day long I was worried about uh, how these girls would respond to this bikini contest, but they were game, so I was pleased. Eliminate. <laughs> Who do you think Adam will eliminate first? Desiree, Tia, Valicia, or Vanessa? So ladies, how do you think the first round went? It was good. Yeah? Did you it was have a good fun. Time? It, yeah. You know, it's, it's come to that point in time where I have to make a decision, and I have to cut, unfortunately, Vanessa. Sweet. I was okay. hoping you would. Really? Uh, yeah. Wow, yeah, was, why? I, when I saw you, I was like, nope. No, nope, you're too short for me. Too you're short? Too short, too small. Okay, next time, don't bring heels. I'm Thanks. the big guy. Well, maybe you should pump up a little bit. Uh, possibly, oh, possibly. You know, Everybody's I got an opinion height. whether or not it's important. That's, uh, that's another story. Yeah, but thanks so a lot. I'm glad you came out on the show. Awesome. And uh, hopefully, uh, well, maybe I'll see you around. All right. Thanks see you. Bye-bye. Bye. <laughs> you know, when Vanessa got cut, her true qualities came out, shined right through. She's a bitch. I'm sorry. She's gone. I just had my fingers crossed that it would be me because I'm just not into him at all. She was just trying to save face. She was mad that she was cut and she couldn't think of anything nice to say, so she had to be rude. Sayonara, sucker. <laughs> Stoked. Thank you, thank you, thank you for cutting me first. In round two, I'm gonna take the girls down to Marina Cantina, get the ladies liquored up and suited up in bikinis and see who looks good. The final part of my master plan, I'm gonna take the girls over and uh, get them into a bikini contest and see how they rock their bodies. Okay guys, so you've been talking about how spontaneous you are and outgoing and willing to try new things, most of you. Um, how do you guys feel about uh, getting into bikinis? Because they, they he is uh, probably for it. <laughs> they, they apply to our next uh, turn of events here. I'm the first one to say no. I won't. Okay. If I have to, I guess I will. Spirit. I, yeah, I guess I will. Okay. All right. We're gonna we're gonna hop over to the store next uh, next door, and uh, you guys have your choice of picking out any bikini you want. Better? Yeah. Sounds good. All right, ready to go? All right. Yep. Let's get out of here. After I revealed to the girls that we needed swimsuits for round three, I took them down to Bikini Beach and got them all suited up. All right, ladies, here we are. Go ahead and uh, do your thing. Pick out whatever you think would make me uh, 
Well, that turned me on. I was shocked when Adam wanted us to come and try on bathing suits. I just think it's not something to do on the first date. How about, do you want to pick out a bathing suit for me? Pick I'm not going to put it suit. on here, but I'll put it on in private. Maybe some sure. other time. Sure. Sure. I enjoyed myself helping the girls pick out the bikinis. I gotta say, it's a first for me, and uh, I hope it's not a last. I thought you were saying you weren't gonna wear a swimsuit. What are you? I'm not gonna wear a swimsuit tonight. Maybe so you later. Just, you just get a free swimsuit, and you don't have to wear it like we do. Well, I'll probably wear it later if Adam picks me. So I don't like that very much. I think that if you have one, you should wear it with the rest of us. I just Definitely. don't want to. I'm gonna stick with my guns and say no. Desiree should totally loosen up. I would totally hate to be her. Her life must be so sad. This, this might be uh, the size you're looking for. <laughs> Why are you gotta get oh such God. a large bottom? Dang. <laughs> she, she's, she's saying you have ghetto booty. <laughs> hey. That's terrible. I've heard guys like that, so that's fine. Yeah, yeah, I've heard that too, somewhere. Why are you guys taking so long? If you're not gonna try it on, you can't talk. Don't go around making fun of other people when you're gonna sit there and be like, oh, I can't try it on because it's my morals and blah, blah, blah. Let's see. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, you little bitch. <laughs> I want you to wear that. I want you to wear that. What? Now, wait a minute, hey, I got distracted hey. there. Desiree tried to throw this little tiny kitty thong at me. I don't know what she was doing. I just didn't want him paying attention to her. I wanted him to pay attention to me. Turn around for me. You do a little spin. Very nice. I came out in a beige bathing suit, and I think Adam liked it. But I wanted to try on a different one, just to see. She's definitely got a rack to show, so she was looking good. I think this is probably my choice. Damn, girl, you got so many tattoos. Thank you. They're so they big. Good. Man, Tia should be covering up those tattoos because I think a lady shouldn't have any tattoos. It's all about the surprise and mystery. I'm sure he I can tell under my mystery. clothing there's no that mystery, there's yeah. nothing to be ashamed of. If there's nothing to be ashamed of, I'll put a suit on. I don't want to. I'm in the dressing room. I can hear him fighting. I'm inside laughing. Just They just can't stop fighting. So this is what you guys are wearing? Which one? Is that your final choice? Yeah. I don't know. Which one? Yeah. This one or the cream one? Did you see the other one? I did not see the other one. I'm thinking, uh, yeah, definitely the Hawaii look. That one's, yeah, that one's good. Part two of my master ideal plan is working so far. I honestly don't know what Adam is up to, but I have a feeling that we are going dancing in our bathing suits. It's my only guess. Coming up, who will Adam cut next? I think that Desiree is going to be eliminated next because she wouldn't put on a bathing suit. I definitely think Desiree is going to get cut because she wouldn't try on this swimsuit and she's way too uptight. I think Adam might actually eliminate me just because I didn't go along with stripping down to a bikini. Eliminate. <laughs> Who is Adam going to eliminate next? Desiree, Tia, or Valicia? All right, ladies, so I've seen you in action. Two of you got suited up in bikinis. Desiree, you didn't uh, get suited up. Kind of disappointed. Um, you know, I mean, it was all kind of part of the game, and uh, I have to cut somebody, and you weren't really willing to play along, so I'm sorry. It's got to be you. Okay. All right. No problem. Okay. I'm just going to stick with my guns, and what you see is what you get. I, I tried to leave a little bit of mystery for you. Well, I respect that. Okay. Thanks for coming. Well, out. thank you. It was All fun. Right. Yeah, thank it was you. you. Good job. Yeah, you nice to meet you. Really well. Oh! <laughs> I cut Desiree because she wasn't willing to go all the way. I didn't buy the whole uh, mysterious, private, unwilling to show herself uh, bit. Well, I'm not surprised. I just tried to maintain a respectable image, and if that's not what type of girl he's looking for, then it wouldn't work out. Desiree, maybe next time, just join the party, have fun, let loose. I'm not really upset. I had a great time, and it was fun meeting new people. All right, girls, you're the final two. You look wonderful. Uh, I want you to put your clothes on over your bikinis and we'll head on over to the Shark Club. Okay. All right. All right. In round three, I took the girls down to the Shark Club and uh, it didn't take long for the fireworks to start happening. So, this is why we're here. This is kind of a big mystery revealed. We're here for the bikini contest. So, you get to get up on stage and show me what you've got. How do you, how do you feel about that? I kind of had a feeling, you know, and I'm, I'm okay with that, I guess. 
Yeah? Yeah. Beautiful. How about you? Yeah. I'm ready to blow you out of the water. <laughs> really? Yeah. I had a feeling something like that was going to happen, and I was up for that. One last question here before we get up on stage. How do you guys feel about intimacy? How do you feel about kissing on the first date? Um, I do kiss on the first date. Do you? Yes. Yeah? Yes. Want to try? Yes. Tia moved in for that kiss without hesitation. All I could think was finally this day was starting to heat up. If that's what she has to do to win him over, then that's what she has to do. You don't, have that? You don't kiss on the first day. All right. I'm, I'm beautiful. Yeah, there you go. I'm lovely. Yeah. All right, ladies, uh, the time has come for you to shine up on stage. So, uh, you ready to go? We're ready to go. All right, let's get it on. All right, Sean Club is Wednesday night. Are you guys ready for a bikini contest? All I could think of was my master plan is all coming into play. These women are game. They're all coming out. They're going to go up on stage and uh, perform in front of everybody. I'm, I'm waiting to see the uh, results. Give it up for Molly Sean. Alicia got up on stage, I couldn't take my eyes off. She's beautiful. Threw off my top, showed my stuff, and it was fun. It was cool. Okay, energy, we got for it. Yeah. She got up on stage, she said she was doing all for me. That's what I'm looking for. Girl to take charge. to deal with the bikini contest, but she kept kissing him. I didn't think that was cool. It was corny. I was definitely trying to make it clear that I was trying to win Adam and not the bikini contest. I own the place, but obviously I didn't because I didn't win, but some guy asked me for my autograph. That was pretty cool. Will it be Tia or Valicia? Adam's final cut is next. A limit <laughs> All right, ladies, we're at the end of the evening. I have to make my decision, and my decision is Tia. Tia, you are the one I choose. So... I'm sorry, I just, I didn't feel like you really wanted to, I don't know, make that extra effort to uh, pull through. I want to kiss you? It could have been it, but it, more so the conversation. So, That's cool. All right. Thank you very much. Yes. I had a wonderful evening. All right, you're live. Okay. All right. She kissed him, and I mean, not once, like five times, so. You know, I chose Tia because she's smart, she's funny, she's outgoing, she really made the effort, and in the end, that's what uh, kind of gave her the advantage over everyone else. I'm just not gonna degrade myself like that. I don't kiss on the first date, and that's that. <laughs>